right, so what we're going to do today is uh, we're going to um, coat this and seal it, uh, especially for out in the, um, let me make sure I'm doing something here, okay. All right, so today what we're going to do is uh, seal this. We want to make sure that it's good for out in the weather. And um, I, I have a, a multi-purpose sealer, which is like a varnish, and it will seal it. It'll make it kind of shiny, but it does do um, a world of good here uh, for this type of um, sealing. And I am going to pour a little bit out on my palette. Uh, it it kind of is a little bit of a runny uh, thing, so uh, I can't really show it to you. It's a milky white. I have my sponge dauber, which you want to use, and we'll begin. I coat my sponge dauber, and we just go and coat it just back and forth. Very easy. Uh, I will speed it up for you so that you don't have to watch me go through this whole process. But I did want to show you how I seal it. Uh, you can use a varnish. Um, I kind of like this product because it does dry clear and it goes on very easy. Uh, it doesn't lift off any of the paint. Um, not that it, the varnish would because uh, we let this dry for about a month. So it should uh, be pretty darn good. And I, like I said, I'll, well, I'm almost done, so I guess I can talk right through it. Um, I'm going to need a little bit more of the sealer. So, just keep on. And you'll see where it's not applied, because this has that shine to it. So you can just go back over it again. And if you want to put a couple coats on, that's fine. But just wait until the first coat dries, um, just to be sure that... There's nothing holding it back or, or, you know, you don't want, it's good to let it dry between coats because if you don't, it's not going to dry properly. So you want to make sure that it dries in between coats. But you just, I always look off to the side to see if I've missed anything because you will see where you missed because it won't be as shiny. And that's what you're looking for. You don't want it to be. Uh, doll in places and then you can just throw your dauber away your sponge dauber that's what's so nice and you're not ruining uh, your, any of your brushes you don't want to ruin any of your brushes so I think we have everything covered and until next time thank you for joining